Knockout Mode is a new game mode coming to CDGP Revolution very soon. It is based around Troy's KO series that he does on YouTube. But if you don't know anything about the series, you probably don't know anything about Knockout Mode. And even if you do watch the series, there are several significant changes that are worth mentioning. So today, I'm going to tell you everything you need to know about the new Knockout Game Mode coming to Mario Kart Wii shortly. As I said before, the new game mode is based entirely around Troy's KO series. If you don't know what that series is about, basically, if you're the last person in the race, then you get kicked out. Then it keeps going into the final match, which will always be a 1v1. The winner of that 1v1 is the winner of the GP, so this means that in knockout mode, the player count determines the amount of races in a GP. 8 players means there will be 8 races, 12 players means that there will be 12 races, and 24 players mean that there will be 24 races. Oh, oh god. Unlike Troy's KO rooms, in the knockout game mode, after you have been knocked out of the room, you will be given an option to spectate the rest of the GP using a brand new and enhanced spectator mode, which will also come in the KO mode update. Sounds like a simple concept, but compared to normal KO rooms that you will see on WeemFi, knockout mode has special options and features that you will only get in C2GP. First of all, there will be an entire six page added to the CTGP settings. Here you can specialize and make your own knockout mode special rule sets. How many players get knocked out? How many bonuses will a player receive? Wait, bonuses? Oh yeah, bonuses are a thing too. Bonuses are an entirely new feature to knockout mode, unseen anywhere else. In the KO mode update, there will be two different bonuses available. Increased track vote odds and bonus items. Increased track vote odds are rather simple to explain. Basically, if you win a bonus, you can get a higher chance of getting the track vote. But the other bonus, bonus items, is the game changer of this game mode. Uh, really quickly, wanted to say that if you like this video, I will drink a cup of water. Also, you should drink water too, it's very important to stay hydrated. Basically, if you win a bonus, you will get the ability to activate a bonus item. These bonus items are able to activate anywhere in the race, meaning if you are in knockout territory, like in last place for example, which will flash red if you are, you can activate a bonus item and receive a bullet, which will probably mean you won't be in last place anymore, I mean based on the circumstances. This can get extremely busted, because bonus items are entirely stackable, and you can save up to 9 bonus items. But wait, you may ask, how do you even receive bonuses in the first place? Well, it's all up to the creator of the room. Bonuses will always be rewarded based on how many points you end up getting. Like, for example, you can set it to every 15 points a player earns, they receive a bonus. Simple as that. Now, these rooms can actually go pretty crazy after bonus items come into play. Oh yeah, and also this is entirely stackable with other game modes. Meaning, hypothetically, you can play a Knockout Countdown Item Rain 24 player 200cc Grand Prix. But hey, if you enjoyed this video about the KO mode update, you'll probably enjoy this video about the BRSDM update coming to CTGP soon. Thanks for watching.